honestly, it was it was crazy because now you're not just doing a new territory of servicing dogs, but you're towing around this thing. Um, and we haven't had experience in towing before, so it was all a brand new experience. So my name is Vera, this is my fiance Miguel. Uh, we service Caulfield North area and um, that's basically our territory. And what we did prior to this was cruise ships. So we used to work on Carnival Cruise Lines, uh, Princess Royal Holland, what else was there, p and um, I did that for four years. You did that for how long? Yeah, for 10 years. You did it for 10 years. We met on the last two years of being there and uh, we decided we had a craving for land life. There was too much at sea. So we decided to move to Australia. We didn't think of buying a, a gyms at all, actually. We just said, we need a business. We need to get a business. Yeah, everything started uh, like, we were looking for a job. We yeah, we were looking job. for jobs. I was yeah. scrolling on Facebook and it says there, be your own boss um, and earn X amount a week or whatever. So I was like, what is this? You know, I thought it was just publicity. So I clicked into it and then I read about it and then I contacted Sharon. Um, who then contacted me a couple days later, did an interview, and now look where we are. So <laughs> it was really taking a leap of faith. So yeah, I was kind of like, you want to join me washing dogs? It's like, okay, cool. So <laughs> that's kind of where it went from there. Seven weeks, we're averaging about 35 dogs a week um, for five dogs a day. Uh, so it's, it's, we're, getting, we're getting really good with our washes now. So <laughs> um, in and out real quick with those dogs as well. But we're, we're going from the small little ones to the St. Bernard's. So we do every size, breed, style and so it's just really a lot of fun. I think the fact that we, like the motto, I don't know, I'll figure it out, or we will figure it out. That's what we do with every situation, every parking space that we can't park in, we figure it out, right? Yeah. And based in the area that we're in, a lot of apartments are around us, so we can't service them, but we figured out a way for them to bring the dogs to us. Yeah, it's been opportunities where we have to actually go to their places, pick out the dog, bring the dog uh, <laughs> home to our place, set up uh, the trailer, like yeah. connect the power, do the dog and take it back. It's like yeah. a delivery like, service. <laughs> driving for but the dog. But it's been fun, it's been fun. Because yeah. we, we, we don't want to say no to someone. Yeah, and especially the area we're in, it's a lot of apartment buildings. And I mean, we can't say no to that, right? Because that's that's our clientele. So I actually have a regular, which I'm doing next week, where I said, are you okay with me picking up your dog? She's like, yeah, sure, cool. <laughs> so I do it every time now. It's a delivery service as well, so. And we're just hungry, that's that's basically it. So it's a can-do attitude and it's there's, there's no no. Like, that's not in our vocabulary, so if you present us with something, we will figure a way out to get at that. From where we are, we've made a nice circle around us. Um, there's been, I mean, in the beginning, I didn't know the, the suburbs, so we were traveling 22 k's for something silly. So, I mean, but now we don't travel anything further than 15. Don't be afraid to get dirty. That's exactly what it is. Like, you need to be able to make sure you get your hands, your feet, everything wet. Like, you're going to come home smelling like a dog, yeah. but it's totally worth it at the end of the day. It might not seem like it, but once you're at the end of the week and you actually see what you've done, you're like, wow. And yeah. you don't even realize the effort that you've put in. And also, I think if you have a passion for helping animals, this is where you need to be. Because some of the dogs that we've gotten, they're so matted or they have not, and they're in pain, right? So for us, it's not more like, oh, this dog is a struggle. It's like, let me help you. Because now that all the knots are off, you can be free and a happy dog, right? So if you have a, a passion for animals and you love to help and service people and just make friends, because we've made a couple good friends with our clients now, this is where you need to be.